One of you was just in there disrespecting Obama, and he walked out like. Good day, man. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. What up, cool nerds? Welcome back to another video. Today, we got another worst knockoffs. Now, y'all need to see this video to the end because some of this stuff is <laughs> really sus. Uh, also, this coming up week, we got another special edition of Struggle Meals. Americans making Mexican food part two. Y'all, yeah. I that's gonna be like its own like side like sub series of struggle meals because the stuff I've been seeing in this little group, bro, I'm putting people on blast. But we're gonna jump right into this. Y'all already know what to do. Smack that like button, sub the notification on. Let's get it. All right. So first up, we got this disrespectful Spider Man. This one says Speeder Man. Okay. I don't know why I said Speeder Man. <laughs> Speeder Man. Uh, but anyways, like then they gave him this whack tagline. Like, don't worry. Like, what's don't worry about like what are you doing bro you know <laughs> this man just like going through your neighborhood like don't worry <laughs> this is like the spider-man like the tuxedo mask of spider-man he, he he just come to the scene and don't do a damn thing and just go off he'd be like all right don't worry i'm out of here bro, bro you even do nothing what the is this? this is not even your friendly neighborhood spider-man this is your nonchalant vigilante arachnid <laughs> bro the disrespect is look what they did to the incredibles this, this is this is your averages. <laughs> this, this is your mediocres. Bro, just look at Dash's eyes. Imagine him trying to save the day. He looked like he'll just run into the enemy and you at the same time. Oh. And then they put Jack-Jack in the front. Like, come on, bro. They got this man looking like an Ape Escape character. If y'all don't know what that is, I'm gonna throw a picture just for reference. Hey, yo. And then they got Mr. Incredible looking like a confused Pop Biscuit can. And y'all, tell me his face don't look like that one meme where the dude was like holding back a cough and his veins were... Bro, editing fresh, throw it up there. I mean, the best part about this whole like picture right here is Elastigirl. They ain't mess her up that bad. I mean, she got a, like a long torso, look like she got a diaper on, but like, you know, Elastigirl, that's, oh, she's so thick. Mm, what? Be gone, fuck! Naburo versus Waterboy. Who, who is that? <laughs> Who's the guy on the right? Like, maybe I'm just missing something. Bro, bro you put, the, you download this to your PC, it's a wrap. <laughs> you, you not getting that PC back, it, it's hacked. <laughs> And then at the bottom, it says the best game of the year. So, so you just put in this on top of Elden Ring. So what's the worst game of the year? <laughs> Bro, Monster? I don't know what brand this is, but Monster Mash. Oh, Monster Mash. It's the great. No? Okay. But anyways, what y'all do to my boy, Freddy Krueger? Bro, they did my man, Freddy Krueger, bogus. They gave him that Where's Waldo shirt. They gave him no type of hips. It's just straight torso and then straight legs. Like my man's arms are straight down to the ground. And that's the thing about Freddy Krueger. He's supposed to be like scary. I don't think Freddy Krueger is one of those like super scary movies. I, I love Freddy Krueger, right? But if this dude showed up my dream, I'm gonna sleep on purpose just so I can see him. I'm gonna be clowning this man. He, he gonna show up my dream, I'm gonna be like, <laughs> Like, if you come into my dream with a Where's Waldo shirt, I'm I'm seeking you. I'm not about to be running for you. I'm trying to find Waldo. And if you zoom in, look at Freddy's face. He got that face like when somebody started kissing on your neck. Daddy, chill. Okay, so right here, we got a Snickers knockoff, right? And we've had Snickers knockoffs on here before. But my thing is that nothing is beating the, like, previous one that we had that it said snipers. Because what if you're at school and someone's like, hey, yo, he got some snipers in his backpack. Jesus Christ, that's Jason Bourne. This one right here looks like they were trying to spell Snickers but they were straight up dyslexic like they were just mixing matching words like how do you even pronounce this a nick serious a nixers hey nick <laughs> okay so we got another spider-man knockoff and this may not even be a spider-man knockoff it could be just a different language maybe they spell like that but anyways spider-man or is it spader-man okay and then it's www.english.com <laughs> okay so not frozen but fashion two, and it says, this is the best present for children. Okay, what is this? This, this looks like cans of like energy drinks maybe, but then it also looks like it could be like a scented candle type thing. What What is happening right here? I'm not going though. Like my children can't have this. I'm gonna have kids. Like something about this, this looks like four locals for kids. <laughs> Okay, so every time we have a Pikachu on here, there's like the little like cute ones, but 99% of the time, the Pikachus are nightmare fuel. Like they, what, like they drew this from memory and was like, best of luck. Like this is not from memory. This is straight up from nightmares. Like on God, I'd rather have that uh, Freddy Krueger in my dreams than this Pikachu. This is the back rooms of Pikachus, right? They got this man with a button up and a bow tie, like that's help, helping the situation. Then you got his twin in the back. No, I'm good. Twin in them? No, pass. 
out of here. Like real talk, like what if your parents bring you here? I I'm getting on my little play school phone and calling CPS because absolutely not. No, you got these Five Nights at Freddy's Pikachus? No, absolutely not. This, this is abuse. This is neglect, okay? Bro, absolutely not. <laughs> Milk Teller? Like, that's not that bad. We've had some really sus looking uh, Nutella knockoffs. And Milk Teller, you know, we, we'll give this a try. Like, there are some other ones where, like, if I had a girl, like, bro, you can't have this one. Like, this, nah, you cheat on me if you eat that. <laughs> Yo, what is happening right here? Was it like Panda Day or something? They were like, hey, let's paint the alligators or crocodiles, whatever, like, like pandas. And then <laughs> I hate the sign in the corner, like, who you really fool, man? Who you fool? You ain't fooling me. Cause what if, also what if like a kid or, or someone fell into the uh, the enclosure <laughs> and they're like, oh, look at this cute panda. <laughs> Bro, I can be mad at this knockoff, right? Cause Jordans are expensive. I'm gonna rock the mics and, and look, look how long they've been wearing them. They've been riding these till the wheels fell off. Bro, like if I get, find some mics, I'm getting them. Okay, these look old reliable. You know what I'm saying? Boy, that hoes clean. If y'all see me rocking some mics, <laughs> mind your business. Cause I'm gonna be walking down the street like, Scaler. I mean, at least they got the like Shrek S in there and stuff like that. But if I seen this like climb my window and I didn't know what it was, I'm shooting my window. Absolutely not. This is frightening. They got this man deep throat in some pole. Like what's happening right now? <laughs> Cheesy ball with a like knockoff SpongeBob. And it looked like he eating one, but he like eating it to the side like. <laughs> bro but for real though if you want a cheesy balls i can just go to the gym and it, what why would you say that that's weird what does it say umar -er under that's what it say under armor what <laughs> bro that's say umar thurman <laughs> At first I look at this and I'm like, maybe it's just like a printing mistake. And then I'm like, no, nah, I'm looking at it closely. No, nah, this is not a mistake, right? And uh, like, for those who don't know, it looks like it's supposed to be Doom, Doom knockoff, but then like, it's mood, you know? You know, and people will be like, oh, I'm chilling. And the other person will be like, mood, <laughs> mood. But then you look closer, Nintendo spelled right. It, it looks like it could be a legit. They got, you know, the ESRB, blah, blah, blah this and that, right? But then I'm like, license is spelled wrong. Bro, you put this in, your whole Nintendo blowing up. Misty looked like she hasn't slept in at least 10 years, right? She looked like she's seen some stuff. She looked like she watched the ring tape. She looked like Pebbles from the Flintstones, but if Pebbles from the Flintstones grew up eating crayons. Like, look at her mouth. Like, what's she been eating on? She like, she she on some stuff. She looked like she dead standing up with her eyes open. Like, like who stands like that? Just hand on the side. <laughs> she straight looked like SpongeBob, like her eyes at least, like when he ain't have no water. Oh, I get it. This is why Bed Bath & Beyond stock went down. Bed Bath & Excedra taking over. <laughs> What's the Excedra? <laughs> they selling the same thing probably, just lower prices. I'm sorry, this this place looks sus. Bed Bath & Excedra is definitely laundering money. There's there's no <laughs> doubts about it. Yeah. Moscow Life Simulator. Bro, I know that's how they get down over there in Russia. I know they got a lot of stuff going on. And, pff, that's none of my business, but like, uh, they got chimpanzees with broadswords? Count me out, bro. I wanna know what goes into the creation process and the thought process of these things and just talk with somebody. Cause we gotta have a global, just a universal meeting across the world because what's happening right here? We have the Pikachu. Every time we have one of these display like, you know, cartoons, they don't look anything like it and they look absolutely frightening. And then it took me a little bit to figure out why this is even creepier because SpongeBob ain't got his two front teeth. This man look like he just straight up drooling. He looks slow. Also, every time they do the eyes, is it like their purpose to make them look like they haven't slept in eons? Like this dude looks like a, a, a SpongeBob zombie. He looked like he about to hit the thriller dance with, with, with no dentures. Jesus did it. Okay, so this person said their parents got them some uh, joggers and this was what was on it. Bro, that's what I like when people buy me clothes. Like I, I love like my anime shirts and stuff like that, but there's a lot of knockoffs of, or just, not even knockoffs. It, it, well, I guess it is knockoffs. It, it's just people who are making clothes like out of their like backyard or their garage or something. Bro, why is this shirt so reflective? You know what I mean? Like this shirt don't need to be that shiny with, like with the anime character. Just print it on like a regular shirt or something, right? Bro, Jesus did it. What do you do? 
Ohio, okay, cream cookies. Bro, nothing beats cream betweens, okay? that That's the craziest Oreo knockoff. And there's always gonna be somebody in the comments like, actually, Oreo is a, a knockoff. Uh, it's so, like, bro, we get it, we get it. Oreos are not the original, we get it. But everyone knows Oreos. What, what's, the, what's the original one? You, you Can you name it off the top of your head without looking up? Shut up. Shut the <laughs> Morphe Mouse. That is a terrible name, by the way. That is like, like a name from like the 1800. Like, hey, what's up, Morphe? Morphisha? <laughs> I like Gertrude. Like, come on, bro. And it, like, why is this cat mouse thing like 50 different colors? And, oh, I, they got the mouse next to it because it's like a play. Like, man, get this out of here. Ah! All right, y'all. So for the last two, you know, we always have like a uh, a restaurant or a fast food restaurant type knockoff. It's, you know, it's common in these videos, right? And for these last two, they might be selling some of the same stuff. But then again, they might not. All right, also first up, we got Obama fried chicken. <laughs> so I'm, I'm sure it's Obama himself cooking it up. I just want to know where this is at because there's two options we have. This food is either fire as hell or butt cheeks. There's, there's no in between. There's just none. And y'all know how people be straight up disrespecting fast food workers, just to, like talking them any type of way because they think that you know they make minimum wage and this. One of you were just in there disrespecting Obama. And he walked out like. <laughs> Good day, All right, so the next question is, would you rather have Obama fried chicken or Hitler fried chicken? <laughs> Bro, like, what if I order from here and like, you know, Hitler hands me my to-go bag, right? And I, I just bite into the chicken and I'm just like, ah! Are all nerds as good as you? <laughs> 